Indians have called for the Delhi Chalo march, protest march from Haryana on February 13th to press the centre to accept several demands, including the enactment of the law to guarantee them the minimum support price for crops. Section 144 has been imposed in northeast Delhi. Haryana government has also announced suspension of mobile internet, bulk SMS and all dongle services in several districts until February 13th in light of these protests as no permission has been granted. Rather, Section 144, prohibitory orders have been imposed instead. Along with that, security has also been beefed up along the Punjab-Haryana border. Meanwhile, India today has learned that over 20,000 farmers likely to join in this protest. Farmers from Punjab, Haryana, Rajasthan, Kerala, Karnataka will be joining in uh, all the way to the national capital. But there are fears that anti-social elements could also join in this uh, movement. Uh, that's what the police fear, that this could turn into a violent showdown. The government has said that the Modi government um, is with farmers. In fact, trying to assure the farmers there's been some communication uh, that's happened between the central government with the farmers union saying the government is with the farmers and was wrong uh, and you know for the betterment of the farmers laws have have been uh, proposed but that will be implemented soon promises will be fulfilled soon these protests should be called off in a way a message has gone to the farmers unions but the protests have been yet scheduled Uh, the farmers have called Chalo Dilli on 13th February, just along the other borders which are connecting Delhi to the NCR states. Uh, here at Delhi Ghazipur border, where the Delhi Merit Highway connects Delhi to UP, has also been prepared by the administration with the barricades, with the police van, with every major that is required. Here I see the loudspeakers are being placed here on the, uh, the panel. There you see the CCTV cameras along with the street light has been placed, and this is. Uh, in anticipation that possibly there could be law and order situation and if the administration fails to contain the farmers at the Shambhu border probably there will be other farmer leaders unions also join in and in that case this Ghazipur border which has been an epicenter during the farm law agitation against the critical farm laws this could be yet again the similar situation and exactly why I see all over these stretches the barricadings have been placed though the highway is open for traffic for now but as and when if there is anticipation of other farmer leader unions uh, joining in via UP entering Delhi via this uh, Delhi Merit uh, highways probably that could again require preparedness and that's exactly what Delhi police has done massive massive placement of the vehicles of the police vans the barricades CCTV cameras everything that is required has been placed here in anticipation of yet again the farm for protest by the farmer groups at Delhi Ghazipur border this is Ashutosh Mishra for India today just look at the way the preparations are being done by the Haryana police at the Shambhu border while CCTV cameras are being installed on the uh, poles here to keep an eye on the protesters the police has already dug up the place between the two bridges of this national highway so that the protesters cannot move towards the Ambala. Uh, these precautions have been taken, keeping in view the scale and intensity which we had witnessed in 2020 and 2021. Farmer unions uh, have uh, decided to march towards Delhi to uh, ask the government, to remind the government about some pending demands, including the implementation of the Swaminathan Commission report, uh, making a law on the MSP besides other demands. Meanwhile, uh, the blockade of the roads, while at one hand is being claimed by the state government that this is being done to maintain peace and law and order, but the farmer unions have criticized the state uh, governments and the union governments saying, if you are inviting the farmers for the talks, then why this barricading and suspension of internet is being done? With Kamra Prasad Aman Gupta, this is Manjit Sagal at Shambhu border for India today. Krishi ke saath saath kisan kalyan mantralya Narendra Modi ji na chala hai. Kisanon ke liye kalyan ke liye anek ko nitiyan le kar aaye. UP ne jitni 10 saal mein khareed ki, usse dugni se jada khareed humne ki aur usse jada paisa bhi diya. Ye saare nirane jo hai kisanon ke hit mein hai. E-NAM se leke ab agriculture infrastructure fund ye saara Modi sarkar ki den hai. Aage bhi किसानों के लाभ के लिए उनकी और आमदनी के लिए जो निर्णय होंगे मोदी सरकार लगातार करती रही
जाने के लिए कोई किसी को रोकता नहीं है लेकिन जिस प्रकार के प्रदर्शन और जिस प्रकार के आह्वान वो लोग करते हैं वो कहीं भी डेमोक्रेसी में उचित नहीं है आखिर पिछली बार हमने देखा है तो जाने के लिए बसें बहुत हैं जाने के लिए ट्रेन बहुत हैं जाने के लिए अपने साधन बहुत हैं लेकिन हम ट्रैक्टर लेकर के जाएंगे और ट्रैक्टर को भी हम आगे कोई ना कोई उनके साथ हथियार बांध के लेकर के जाएंगे हम कोई रोकेगा तो हम रुकेंगे नहीं लॉ एंड ऑर्डर की स्थिति को मेंटेन करने के लिए व्यवस्थाएं करनी पड़ती हैं और इसलिए जैसा हमारा पिछला अनुभव है आपको पता ही है इस प्रकार का काम किसी प्रकार का प्रदर्शन डेमोक्रेसी में जो तय मानक है उसके हिसाब से करना चाहिए जो तय मानक नहीं है उसके हिसाब से नहीं करना चाहिए गवर्नमेंट है डिसाइडेड दे आर वर्क एज एजेंट ऑफ दॉर्पोरेट दे वॉन्ट टू डिस्ट्रॉय अवर फार्मर्स एग्रीकल्चर and make it a corporate agriculture so they are not listening because of that we have given a call of bharat band rural bharat band on 16 february so our our movement is continuing till the government accept our demand sangyukta kisan morcha is there they are very much in all india level everywhere in the country and we will continue and 20 uh, 16 february will be very successful band all india against this government's inaction sajno एक पास सरकार लगातार गलबात का दौर शुरू कर रही है और कह रही है कि गलबात ने दरवाजा खोल के रखो गलबात चलती रहे आंदोलनकारी बिल्कुल पॉजिटिव ने कि अभी गलबात नहीं तैयार हाँ गलबात करते रहेंगे और कदे भी किसान गलबात तो ना भजया ना भजेगा परंतु समझ नहीं आ रही बड़े सितम की गल है बड़ी हैरानी की गल है ये जिंदगी च कदे नहीं होया कि एक पास गलबात का दौर चल रहा हो दूजे पास सरकार दहशत फैला रही हो